Hello everybody, it's Millie and welcome back to Millie's Island. And if you remember in the last episode, I ended up losing everything because I got burnt up in the lava. So today I I really wanted to go back to the nether. And I know I know it's like, oh, did you go back after you lost everything? Oh, by the way, this I am very glad, glad I didn't loot this chest before I died because at least I have a little bit of stuff to bounce back on. But anyways, oh, messed everything up. Uh, yeah, anyways, <clears throat> I did want to go back to the nether, but first I wanted to go to my house and basically just craft um, all a lot of the stuff that I lost. So, um, for the first part, um, I gotta go back home, replenish my resources. I really need to check this, the current state of my iron, because I'm not sure if I even have any. But I could have sworn I didn't take all of it, so it should be fine. But yeah, then after that, I want to try and exit that cave that my that I seem to be stuck inside of in the nether. And I think I have a plan for how I'm going to do that. So I'm just going to uh, go to my house. I think I'm just going to cut it right here. And I will be at my house. Wow, that's actually a very nice silhouette. I wish I could screenshot it, but it's just going to have to be in my memories. I'm finally using the dock for the first time. I just realized that because I haven't been back since that first one. So my boat can stay there. Now let me quickly get inside so I can start getting my resources together. Look at this view. Then, but unfortunately the sunset, I think, sunset's that way. So I'll, I won't be able to see the sunset, but I can see the moon rise. There's a spider. A good thing I keep it well lit over here so monsters don't decide to show up and ruin things. I'm just gonna uh, take a lot of take a lot of the junk out of my inventory, and I'll get back with you when I finish. Oh, good. Um, I still have 64 iron, so I'm glad I didn't take all of it with me, so now I can craft the rest of my armor along with a shield. And I hope I don't forget, but I will be explaining like the full reason why I'm going to the nether. But first, um, I'm just going to finish doing my inventory. All I needed was the meat. Then I can go to sleep and head back over to where the nether portal is. I'm I'm not sure because I kind of want to move the nether portal over here. But because I, I feel like it would be easier for me to just go in and out instead of having to cross the river and go to the village. But then again, I know the monsters can crawl through the portal so I think it's I think it's good where it is so I think I have everything I should have checked before I left the house 
Yeah. I'm not very confident on the amount of wood I have. But for the most part, um, I think I'm prepared. One of these days, I gotta head back to that mushroom island. But, um, I just feel like I haven't fully completed, uh, what I started it on my main island, so... I, I just want to save the mushroom for last. And when I, whenever I do start to build on the mushroom island, I want to go all out. And here is the portal on the horizon. Horizon. Ooh, this looks like a nice place to park my boat. Hopefully I don't forget I put it here. Alright. It's the moment I've, we've all been waiting for. It feels a bit too soon to revisit this place, but... Man, I want to get some netherite already. Set my respawn point, and of course I'm gonna put some valuables in here. Split my candles, cause I just, I just want, just in case I were to die, I want to have something to come back to. Um, I'll put my beef in here. Apples don't need those. Okay, and of course my map. You don't really need the map in the Nether. Unless you're trying to make teleportation spots. Oh, I need that. Alright, set my spawn point again. And here we go! Okay. So, hmm, these guys are still here, but I feel more prepared. Come back. Oh, I gotta turn off the zoom. I don't know why I turned back. Why don't I just finish them off? Oh my goodness. You can't just attack me, then turn back around. Okay. That's all of them for now. So it should be safe enough to turn the zoom off. Alright, I'm back. So, now to get out of this cave. I'm thinking about tunneling. Um, but I'm also scared the same thing is going to happen to me. Like what happened over here. But I think going down is our best bet. So, I'm just going to start like right beside the portal. And I'm also going to be very careful. Alright, I've been tunneling down, and I still haven't hit anything, so I'm starting to get... I'm starting to feel like my time is being wasted by doing this. There's quartz. Get some XP back. I know I just... I just can't put off... Because I can't move the portal, you know? So, uh. I don't even know what to say. I just want to get out of that area and be able to explore the nether.
Look at us, we already reached level 9. We were just at level 8. I'm at level 4. Okay, where were we? Just like that. Just gonna cover this up because it doesn't need to be visible. <gasps> well, looky here. Look what I found. I trusted the process and it worked. Oh, but look. It's a it's a piglin. And I know they're hostile for the most part. And then there's those hoglins. What am I gonna do? Look, I, I'll just I just won't fight them unless they wanna try and fight me. <gasps> Ow! Someone's already angry. I heard that growl. And build some stairs so I can have a quick escape. Wow, these trees are pretty. Okay, I'm definitely going to be building with these. I think this is like the bush part. Those noises are haunting. Shroom lights. What, what kind of tree is this? Crimson... Crimson stem. Crimson stem. Oh, those are pretty. The, the planks look so nice. They look like vanilla. They're scared. Because I know they see me and they know they want to fight me. Uh oh, okay. Oh no. I'm sorry, I'm not wearing gold. It's like I'll, I'm just gonna have to kill them all. Oh my gosh. I'm scared. Last one, I cannot die to him. Let me eat something. So, cause I am on half a heart. Okay. Okay, there. Got rid of them. I'll do anything for these warped trees. They just look so nice. They look delicious, actually. And I like the sound they make when they break. It's like very crisp wood. We're not, it's like squishy wood. Take some shroom lights. Don't know what I would use the shroom lights for though. Hopefully, another fortress is nearby. So I can get some nether wart. Ooh, and then once I get a uh, nether wart, I can build like a potion house or something. I can't believe I forgot to wear gold. Because these guys are just going to keep spawning. Let's go this way. Can I take these home with me? That's these are pretty as well. Those are some pretty vines. Uh-oh. They noticed me. Uh-oh. This one has a bow and arrow. Okay, we're good. <laughs> Sorry guys, 
You came at me first. I'm just gonna keep collecting this uh, warped tree because I want to build something out of it soon. Hopefully nothing attacks me while I'm mining. And get some vines, cause I like how these vines look. I want to go deeper, but I'm scared I'm gonna get lost. But this wood is just so nice looking. I got, I almost got two stacks of 64. Is there a fortress nearby? I don't think fortresses spawn in this biome. Oh, well, well. Uh oh. This is a hostile. It's just a zombie. Hopefully he. Oh, that's not a zombie. Why would they do that? Why would they make the texture for the zombie the same as the texture for the zombie pigmen? Unless I wasn't paying close attention. Man, I was really hoping I would spawn near a, um, uh-oh, from where? I'm gonna wait for him to reload again. Uh-oh. Uh. You can't just... Oh. Uh-oh. You either want to fight or you want to run away? So getting some bacon out of this. Get over here. Oh, that was a baby. Nope, I'm not going down there to fight those guys. Hope they don't have a way up. Ooh, is this gold? I could really use some gold nuggets right now. Cause these guys really want to fight me. Crafting table. Okay. Three. I just need one more so I can make a pair of boots. I'll eat the apple first. This guy is coming towards me, but I don't know if it's okay. So this is a zombie piglin, pig, pig, pig man. So I'm not going to mess with him. See, I like those guys. They just let you mind your business, or more like mind your business. Uh oh. How do they get over here? Maybe if I build build around myself. Okay. Uh oh. Well that's not good. They're just sitting out there guarding me. I'm actually, when I finish with this one, I think I'm gonna look up how to get netherite. Uh oh. He must have good aim because he got me through the, from the other side of the wall. 
This isn't good. Hurry up and heal. Okay. I don't know why they want to fight me so bad. I'm a peaceful fellow. Okay, let's get out of here. Ah! There's so many! Just dodge and weave, dodge and weave. And build up. Okay, let's let's check the fruits of our laborers. Ninety nine plus. Okay, that that's good. I'm not even sure what I came here for, but I'm glad I got this uh warped wood because it looks it looks very pretty, and I'm just gonna keep repeating myself because it it does. I wonder if I can at least pick up some. Oh, come on. These guys are really getting on my nerves. I got quiet. I was very- I was concentrating very hard because I didn't want to die. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's clog that up because that's a hazard. Okay. I just want to know what's over here real quick. I really regret leaving my gold at home, but I don't feel like going back for it exactly. Ugh, so annoying. That's why I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Okay. I'll come back with gold armor on so they won't be harassing me. For just minding my business. Jeez, these guys are so impolite. And it looks like we've run out of time. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you put a smile on your face. And I will see you next week. Goodbye. That's me waving goodbye. <laughs>